girlfriend this whole time? Oh my god. I thought I thought it was just like a slight romance bar. Honest, I thought we just had like a thing. I did not know we were officially dating. <laughs> Hello my friends and welcome back to the Nightmare Legacy Challenge. I swear every time I load back into this save file, there's just something going on. There's floating plates right here, the baby's upset. There's just, there's always a bunch of disaster happening in this house. I want to try and celebrate Harvest Fest in a second, but first I just want to triple check on the weather. Okay, because last episode my sim got struck by lightning inside, so I kind of just want to make sure that it's not going to be raining in the next couple days. There's really been a lot happening recently, but to catch you up to speed, we currently have an infant. Her name is Dory, and oh, she's missing. Okay, if I unpause, will she appear? Okay. <laughs> she faded back in. Um, you know, that was kind of scary. Uh, at this point, I'm not even surprised. Okay, so everything appears to be fine for now. My main goal for today, though, is just to celebrate the holiday, but also maybe to hopefully work on Dory's, like, skills and stuff. I guess skills are the wrong word, but I want to work on Dory's milestones, because I would hope that she could try to, like, sit up and stuff. Are you doing okay? Oh, Marina, you are. Good. Do you want to do tummy time? No, 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 no. The kid's not even tired. <laughs> Pick her back up. Please? Please? Okay. Yeah, we're off to a bad start. <gasps> <laughs> Just deep breaths, everybody. We'll get through this today. <laughs> it might take us some time, but we'll get there. Okay, maybe I will feed the baby and then we can try and do some tummy time. Please don't fall asleep. Please don't fall asleep. Oh my God. Oh my God. Ah! <laughs> Well, the first time I said, oh my God, was because my son is a picky eater. The second time, and this is worse, um, my ex-girlfriend has called me. So this is going to sound crazy. I know we're friends and all, but well, okay, here it goes. I have a crush on you. All right, this is my fault because we like had a thing in high school and then I never officially ended it. But I sort of hope that when I, you know, didn't speak to her for 10 years, she would have caught on. Um, I'm ghosting her. <laughs> Please, I do not want to date you. I'm busy. Hmm, I guess you're not responding. Does that mean you don't want to hang out with me? Yes. Yes, it does. We had a thing. I'm done with the thing. Please. <laughs> oh my god, this game is scary. Okay, how are you doing? You're picky, so you didn't like the meal. Oh, the cat ran away. Do you know what? I'm terrible. I don't even know what's going on in this household half the time. <laughs> I like didn't even notice the cat had run away. <laughs> that makes me feel really bad. There's just, listen, listen, I'm overwhelmed. I I loaded into this save five minutes ago and I'm just, it's a lot. Oh, Chester returned. Oh, okay, good. <laughs> All it took was me posting like one alert. That actually worked out pretty well. Um, would you like to welcome Chester back? Um, just so the cat doesn't run away again? That would probably be useful. Barb, are you cooking for me? I think Barb keeps getting food and then leaving it out. Uh, it looks like she's done it four times. Is this like a vampire thing? <laughs> She, I invited her to stay over and help with the baby. I've noticed that stay over guests cook a lot, but she never finishes cooking. Perhaps it's because she only eats blood. That, that would probably be part of it. It's a little bit inconvenient for me personally though. Like it would be a lot more useful if, if um, you would clean it up at least. Oh, the kid fell asleep on the floor. Well, maybe while she's asleep, I can add like a mobile to this. <laughs> That'll make our life a little bit easier. There we go. Okay, Barb is cleaning, but then she just put the dirty plates on the floor next to the baby. Oh, never mind. We're back helping. Okay, she just scraped out the trash in the diaper bin. <laughs> she left like old tofurkey in the baby's bedroom. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, do you want to wake up Dory though? No, 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 go to sleep. We have such little time while they're infants on short lifespan. Like I really want Dory to get some milestones, but I don't think, oh, okay, we're on the balcony. I don't think we're going to be able to <laughs> just because it's all going to happen so fast. What's that? Ouch from upgrading. Lift head milestone unlocked. Good job. Okay, now she's exhausted, so you could probably put her to bed. I don't think everybody else got a chance. Oh no. Who do you think lost in the family? Who? Not us. Oh, I didn't get a pop-up, so I don't know who died. Should I check the mailbox? If we just open a ton of these neighborhood stories, maybe we'll see if anything bad happened to someone we know. Some people died, but like, I don't know Benson, so I'm not really that worried about that. <laughs> I guess it's probably somebody on their dad's side. <gasps> oh my god, it's not. Jacqueline died? Jacqueline got a little too angry and exploded? <gasps> no. Oh, what's gonna what happened to their kids? Oh no! <laughs> Okay, Jacqueline was baby's aunt, so it was her uncle's wife. They had eight kids together. One of them's only an infant. Jacqueline got too angry and exploded? That's like a violent death too. Oh no. <sighs> okay, happy Harvest Fest. <laughs> 
<laughs> what a lovely thing to happen on a holiday, huh? Should I go try and get her grave and bring it to the graveyard? Oh my god. At least, okay, at least there's like adult kids here that can help take care of the younger one. <laughs> but this is really unfortunate. She was probably gonna live forever too because she had so many kids. When Sims are pregnant, they don't age. And she had like eight pregnancies. So she was like gonna live forever um, until, you know, story progression said no. <laughs> Neighborhood story said absolutely not. Leave me alone. I just want my grave. Oh, Jacqueline, I'm so sorry. This house does not have enough beds for all these kids either. But look, this is not my problem. I just came here for the gravestone. Um, <laughs> sorry. I got babies of my own to worry about. Sorry, sorry. Well, I just buried Bo here, so I can bury her next to him. Our graveyard's getting actually quite big. I'm glad that I went and got her grave, but um, I don't really want to spend a lot of time here because the vibes are not so pleasant. So I'm just gonna go back home and pretend that that did not happen. Okay, well, way to ruin the evening, but I think I'm just gonna have everybody go to sleep. Wait, who put the kid there? Oh my god. I will never understand this about these sims. You probably shouldn't put the kid to bed because you're miserable. How are you? Also miserable. Why are you grilling? <sighs> If you're that tired, you're so tired that you're close to passing out and you're grilling instead of just going to sleep. Well, I guess I could just leave the baby there. <laughs> she can sleep in her brother's room on the floor. She's fine. It might be okay. Okay, well, everybody's asleep now. Aside from my guests, both of them are still awake. <laughs> <laughs> just like kind of wandering around. If you're gonna be up, can you at least help? You could like, I don't know, clean out the spoiled food, pick up these things you left out. It is so interesting to watch them because they really do just stay up all night. Oh no. <laughs> the cat's drinking the spoiled cake batter. Great, perfect. Oh no. Okay, now the baby has woken up. <laughs> oh, she learned how to grab things. Well, that's good. Nobody else is really that awake yet. So this is kind of inconvenient. Do I have any toys? Do you want this? No. Okay. <laughs> she can't do anything. She actually can't do anything on her own. Okay, well, baby doesn't have any gigs yet. So maybe I'll make baby come help. She kind of has the day off work today. So this can be her problem. <laughs> oh no, the toddler's awake too. Okay. Oh, oh no. <gasps> I forgot. I was gonna try and have his birthday to celebrate. Oh, he's gonna age up. Oh, I'm terrible. I forgot his birthday. He's autonomously aging up right now. Oh, little guy, I'm so sorry. <laughs> birthday. Short lifespan happens too fast. It's very scary. Well, <laughs> we randomized traits here, so I guess I'll just- We're a kleptomaniac. We steal things. These sims don't mind borrowing things from others. Great. <laughs> Perfect trait. We could probably use one of the new kids' aspirations, though. Maybe I could pick playtime captain. We can seek out active play with friends. Perhaps? I'm sorry. I'm so, so, yeah. so sorry. So he wants to play on splash pads, get level three motor skill. I guess I can redo his outfits. Oh, maybe I'll randomize his likes and dislikes too. Okay, so we don't like yellow. We enjoy S-pop music. We like argumentative sims and small talk. What a weird combo. And we also don't like knitting, okay. <laughs> When I do the randomize button, I get like the weirdest combinations of things sometimes. I'll take it though, it's fine. I think I might use this new hair from high school years. Well, I guess it's not really that new anymore, <laughs> but it feels new to me still. It's new-ish, okay? Oh, we could try some of the new clothes from Growing Together too. I know it's a styled look, but I honestly kind of like this. I think this is kind of cute though. Okay, so here's what I've picked as all of his outfits. I gave him this for cold weather, hot weather, swimwear, party wear, sleepwear. Athletic, formal, and everyday. I think it's kind of cute. I used a lot of the new growing together stuff, mostly because I really haven't used a lot of it yet. This always happens when a new pack comes out. I kind of like obsessively use all the new cast and build items at first. I'll probably need to redo his bedroom too, but to be honest, I might wait until we age up the baby and I'll do them both at the same time. Do you want to come get some leftovers, kid? Ooh, you could probably also sleep again. I guess you do need a bed then. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. It must be horrible to wake up in the middle of the night to age up against your will. Like he had a birthday and he didn't even get a choice in the matter. It makes me feel bad because I like, I remember last episode, I was like, oh, we'll celebrate his birthday. I did, I forgot. Oh no, everyone's miserable. I'm really sorry to make you do this again, but it's tummy time. I want to get milestones. <laughs> I'm going to sit here and keep doing this until she can sit up. Dory right now ages up in zero days. So we're running out of time. Who milestone on? Locked. That's cute, but that's not sitting up. <gasps> Roll over to back milestone. Oh, that's good. We're getting there. We gotta do it again though. I'm sorry. I know she's getting tired, but <laughs> you gotta keep going. 
this is broken. What are you doing? Oh, you're just feeding them. I'm sorry. You see a person like queue up an interaction with my shark pawn, and I think I understandably get a little bit concerned. How about this? Do you want to come swing? I think that I put these swings so close to the bushes that he's gonna swing like right into them, but that's okay. Yeah, that's fine. <laughs> just don't look that closely at it, and maybe try not to fall off because it looks like it might kind of hurt. Oh my god, baby's going back to bed too. It's only 11 a.m. and she's exhausted. <laughs> Having an infant is so difficult. It's like actually very hard, miserable work. Oh no. Can you feed me? Barb, it's time for you to help. Wait. Oh, I can roll over on my own. Oh, good. Well, Barb, uh, I'm gonna rely on you in a minute because I'm gonna need some food. Do you want to feed me? And then do you want to change my diaper? Mom is asleep. So it's time for you to step up, Barb. Oh, she's screaming. Please feed me. Please, 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 please. No, that is not what I asked for. I, Barb, I specifically said food and diaper. There we go. Okay. <gasps> <laughs> These people are too much. Oh, he's swimming. Oh, that's cute. Can you clean any of this? You can clean a little bit of it. You can't pick up these things, but you can try. Maybe you can come try to talk to your uncle or something. That could be nice. Your social's low, so it might help. Oh my God. All right, well, good thing I put her to bed. Cause look, <laughs> all right, sorry. Yeah, this is helping. Not the favorite, but why can't baby be the favorite? What did she do wrong? Oh, I had Silver say that Bryce was his favorite. I didn't know that was gonna upset baby. <laughs> oh, that makes me feel really bad. I, I just thought it would be cute if like he loved his uncle. I didn't know that was gonna make her upset. That makes me feel really guilty. Okay, well, Gary aced his exams. That's good. At least somebody here is doing well in this household. <laughs> it's not a common occurrence, but at least someone's doing okay. You wonder if I want to stop by to meet the new kitty you adopted? You got a cat? Ugh. Well, I, the thing is, normally I would say yes, except today you called me out of the blue and said you had a crush on me. I don't mind, I'll go. Maybe I can like dump Isabella finally, because I've really been avoiding doing that. It's not on purpose, I just kind of forget about it. But now that she's called me and like confessed her love, I probably should. Because <laughs> I don't want baby to cheat on Marina, like that's not the plan here. I just have this person who I forgot to break up with for years. So I'll handle it, I'll handle it. Oh, I forgot they lived across the street. That is like exceptionally inconvenient. <laughs> okay, well here's the cat, its name is Wally. I mean, you're cute, so that's good. They still have the graves from gen one. <laughs> <laughs> this is from like so long ago. That's so weird. All right. Well, I came here because I wanted to break up with you. So, <gasps> wait, are we? Oh, <gasps> she's been my girlfriend this whole time. Oh my God. I thought, I thought it was just like a slight romance bar. Honest, I thought we just had like a thing. I did not know we were officially dating. Oh my God. Um, you know, that is really bad. <laughs> I thought she, oh no. Okay, um, wow. So not only was I dating her, but she lived across the street this whole time while I went out and got a new girlfriend, got engaged to that new girlfriend, had two kids with her, <laughs> got married to her. I mean, oh no. Um, yeah, Isabella, I gotta go. <laughs> I'm sorry, but I gotta go. Baby just broke up with Isabella, yikes. Am I gonna have a milestone from that? Huh. <laughs> Um, this is really awkward. I just gotta leave. I I just, um, I'd like to go home now. Thank you. <laughs> Sorry. I feel like baby shouldn't be upset. Like, I don't think she should be crying about this. I feel like if I didn't know, baby didn't know either. This really feels like one of those things where, like, as a child, you, like, get married to some kid in your kindergarten class, and you, like, you know, pretend as a child, and then you forgot about it because you were five, and then, you know, 20 years later, what, you're still married? <laughs> That's what I feel like has happened here. I brought her with me? No, 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 no. Isabella will not see you there. No, 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 no. You need to leave. You need to leave. Bye. Thank you. Bye. Yeah, you should get going now. Okay. I can't believe this has happened. I'm just trying to like play with my Sims, have some kids, have a nice happy family. And it turns out I've been cheating on everyone for years. I didn't mean to. Poor baby. Look at this. Loss of the family, breakup blues. Yikes. Okay, well maybe I will redo this room a little bit to make it have some like older 
stuff. I might keep this little corner with the books and stuff because I kind of like that. There was a floating plate in there too and it had pizza. I might move our little gallery wall to the hallway too because I'm not sure if he's gonna want to have like his mom's pregnancy photos in his bedroom anymore. I could see him wanting to have like, you know, his own decor. You know what? I kind of want to have a bunk bed. This one has some cool colors and then maybe we could get a desk underneath it because that way he can use it to do his homework and stuff. I think that's nice. It's only a slight change. We still have like most of the same furniture, but he's only young. So I feel like it makes sense that he might like, you know, have some same furniture still. And then as he gets older, we can slowly change stuff. Oh, that pizza's still not spoiled. Do you want to try and eat some? Hold on. <laughs> Do you want to come try that? That's just been in your room this whole time. My favorite time of day is when we play together. Says who? Who are you talking to? Are you talking to yourself? Okay. Well, that's cute. The baby's asleep again on the floor because no one ever puts her in her crib. Yeah, you know what? I think I might make baby clean up all of this because her siblings keep just leaving mess everywhere. <gasps> no. Oh, Dory's getting a lot older. I don't want her to age up. I don't want her to age up. Do you want to wake up? Do you want to try tummy time on your own, please. Creep milestone unlocked. <gasps> Good, we're getting there. That means she can crawl soon. Not that it matters because she's gonna age up. Yeah, it's her birthday now. Um, well, I'm not aging you up. As long as I can last without aging you up, I'm gonna do it. Oh, he likes video games. You can like video games, that's cute. It's almost baby's birthday. Oh my God. <laughs> Short lifespan is so scary. We're almost adults already. Oh no, Gary's grilling. Why do they always do this? It's like, honestly, why do I even have all these grills? I just like how they look, but I feel like all these Sims autonomously grill so much. Like to the point where it's dangerous because they light it on fire. Although we haven't had any fires today. I don't want to speak too soon and jinx anything, but we've actually been doing all right. <laughs> oh, Bryce is finally sleeping, but I don't have a guest room. I guess that's part of the problem. <laughs> I think that there's no room for them to roll out sleeping bags. And also I don't have a guest room, so there's no bed for them to sleep in. Night on the town was awful. Okay, sorry, baby. You have two small children. You can't be getting out much. Maybe soon when they're a little bit older, but not now. <laughs> We got stuff to worry about at home. Okay, I'm sorry to do this, but like, Dory, you're not that tired. Do you wanna wake up and do tummy time? Look, she can move around loads on her own. <gasps> Hold on. Oh, she sat up. Okay, that means that I can finally try food in the high chair and that is all I cared about. <laughs> Oh wait, can you talk to your sister? Oh, we could like talk to her and play peekaboo and stuff. Oh, that's actually really cute. Outshined from watching siblings milestone. That was it. Big deal. Silver's been doing that for years. Okay, Silver. <laughs> We get it, you know how to sit up. You know what, it makes sense that he's upset though. Cause he never even got the chance to learn how to sit up because he never even got to be an infant. He was pre-infant update, he never even got the chance. Oh, that's quite sad. And I forgot his birthday today. No wonder he's having a hard time. Here, um, kid, do you want a, uh, do you want a tree house? I can get you a tree house. I don't know how I'm gonna finish building this and I don't know where to put it. Is that like totally random there? Maybe. Well, I've got, I mean, I got three dead cow plants and a shark pond. Nothing is too random. <laughs> it's fine. Your brother Gary might like that too though. Maybe we could all work on it together. Do you wanna help build it? Oh, these two are not having a good time. Do you want a woohoo so I can get your fun up? Sorry, don't take care of the baby. She's fine. Look, see, Barb's taking care of her. Wait, you didn't change me. Can I have a bath? Get a bath from Barb, please. Look at how smelly she is. Help! <laughs> it's urgent. Okay, there we go. Oh, both these sims are miserable. Starving and sad. Yikes. Well, I was just trying to get our fun up and it worked. Oh no, cat's miserable. Do I still have vet treats? Yes, okay. Don't worry, I got wellness treats. We don't have to go to the vet because I've got this. That actually looks really painful. <laughs> like burning feet. There we go, problem solved. Maybe I'll talk to you for a sec too. Just so you don't like run away again because that is really annoying when that happens. It makes me look bad when you run away and I'm filming the video, okay? I just cleaned all this. They keep making more mess. Bryce is at least picking up one of them. See, why would you put me to bed instead of feeding? Me. How does that make any sense, Barb? Embarrassed? <gasps> Performed poorly from below average woohooing. My god. Okay. <laughs> well, you were both in a really bad mood, so. Wait, are you feeding me? No, you're not feeding me. Barb? Why did you come talk to me and then not feed me? These house guests are actually not that helpful. I've realized. Well, I'm asleep now, so whatever. That's fine. New family dynamic jokesters. Yes, that's really cute. Oh, Barb and her sister can be jokesters together. I love that. Okay, and now she's hissing at me. I love that less. Okay, Silver has high confidence right now, which is good. Hopefully we can keep that going. I'm gonna let him go like play on the swings and stuff to work on his motor skill too. It's also almost Garrison's birthday. So we'll have to prepare
prepare for that as well. And maybe now the kids are getting a little bit older, I could probably get another acting gig. It's been a while. <laughs> maybe I could sign up for a good one, like growing up crumple bottom. How about that? We'll have an audition for that tomorrow. I need handsiness level three. Oh, I do have it. Oh, oh, I'm working on it right now. Oh, well, that's good. Yeah, this treehouse looks super weird here in the front of the lot. <laughs> this is super random. But the whole lot is like that, so it's probably fine. Uh-oh, kid's awake. Help, 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 please feed her. I didn't want to wake her up, but we need to feed her now. Oh, Garrison and Silver are jokesters together. That's cute too. I like that dynamic. I like the sort of friendly, jokey one that pops up. I don't like it when it gives me the strict one. Oh no, 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 no. Oh, okay, never mind. sorry. It's just Jay. I don't even know who that is. <laughs> I saw the pop up of like a family member dying and I was like, oh no. But look, see our dad, Anthony, had loads of siblings. I don't know these people. I'm not that worried about it. So, um, Sorry. While we're up, can we have Dory try her first baby food? It's really important to me. She needs to do this at least once before she ages up. I spent all this time trying to get her to sit up, so I need to take advantage of it. <laughs> I will have a baby food, thank you. Oh, I think she liked the carrots. No, she was unsure about carrots. Okay, never mind. I tried. Do you want to try yogurt? Come on. Like at least something. Oh, she loved yogurt. Okay, that's good. That makes me feel better. I feel like I succeeded in helping her. Oh, you feel sad about being outshined too? Oh, it makes me feel really guilty because like, obviously I know it's just a funny little silly thing that The Sims has added and it's gonna happen to all of my Sims, but I think I feel guilty that the boys feel outshined because they are outshined. Like, no matter what they do, they're gonna be outshined by the baby because this is the first ever infant we've had. <laughs> <laughs> so it's not their fault. It's not my fault. It's just like the infant update came out and you are outshined And I'm sorry that you feel that way, but I it just makes me feel really bad Are you gonna go cry about it? See that makes me feel awful. He wants to cry it out Oh, it's not your fault if only you were born like a few weeks later <laughs> You could have been an infant too. Okay, well I'm getting cranky and I have a fun need now that I can sit up, but I'm probably just gonna go to bed. I think I might end this part right here too. We're kind of reaching a good point where I could maybe stop and also it's starting to rain. So I'm getting a little bit nervous that somebody's gonna get struck by lightning again. <laughs> you get struck by lightning inside one time and all of a sudden you're a little bit paranoid. The only reason we got struck last episode, if you guys watched it, it was sort of like in this exact situation, baby was putting the baby in the crib. Confusing, I know everybody's a baby, but this sim, adult baby, <laughs> was putting the baby down in the crib because she had like put the kid down outside and I was like, why are you doing that? Pick the kid up. And I think while she was out here, the game queued to strike her with lightning. But I don't think that you can get struck by lightning while holding an infant because I, I mean, I guess that makes sense. So it waited until she put the baby down up in the crib to then strike her. So she was like gonna get struck here, but she walked all the way inside, came up, put the crib down and then got struck and it terrified me. So now, yeah, there's a lightning storm. Yeah, now I'm just a little bit nervous about the possibility of that happening again. <laughs> and I think that's reasonable. I, I think it's fair that I feel that way. Even Gary's gonna take a panicked poop. Great. <laughs> just great. Okay, well, I'm gonna have all these- oh my god! It struck right there! Yeah, 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 yeah. Pause save the game, and I'm gonna end this episode. <laughs> That's enough, I'm good. Next episode, we can age the baby up. Maybe I'll throw like a family reunion party or something as an excuse to get the cousins together and then we can age up the infant. And then we can also just like, you know, try the new party, <laughs> which will also be fun. I think we did okay. Considering we're on short lifespan, we can't really get that many milestones. Like it only lasts a couple days, so I did my best. <laughs> I hope that you enjoyed this episode. Thank you for watching and I'm gonna catch you all tomorrow. Okay, bye everybody. I can't believe that I feel actually guilty and like bad about hurting a Sims feelings. It's like a virtual doll, Kayla. It's okay. <laughs> I just, I genuinely feel bad about it. I need to calm down.